Hello everybody, this is Sam of Bimser International. In this video, we will demonstrate how you can add a new render through Eber to Archimedica. Before we start, this is the flow of this solution. I, Sam, will be the form creator. Once I send out my form, the form will be sent to the purchase manager who named Janet. The form goes to Ashley from finance department right after having Janet's approval. With the final approval from Ashley, the form will send back to me and get saved on Archimedica. Let's get started. After logging into Eva web application, I'm going to show you a fully digitized form of creating a new vendor. If you click into the flow scheme, a visual representation of our form approval flow will be shown. After the user fill up the form and initial the flow, the form will be sent to the purchase manager. Once the purchase manager reviewed the form and approved it, the form will be sent to the finance department accordingly. At last, the form goes back to the flow starter and waiting for the confirmation of sending to Archimedica. If the form got rejected from either department, it will be sent back to the flow starter for revision or amendment. I will now show an example through the flow and show how the form can be done and get saved with the amazing customized method of Eva. All the required fields with an asterisk have to be filled. Otherwise, a notification will pop up as a reminder. Also, there are some restrictions for some fields as well. For example, when the ID can have a maximum length of 10 letters, email has to be in a proper email address format. If we want to, we can also attach any documents or files to the render form. When everything is done and confirmed, we can hit send button and the form will be waiting for approval from Janet, the purchase manager. Here, log in as Janet, we can see our form awaiting approval. We can click on it and it brings us to the form we just filled out along with some additional information. At the bottom, there is a new session, the approvals list, which shows us who sent the form. We can also check out the department their form, the type of action they want, and the date they request it. Documents attached to the form if necessary. Once all is revealed and checked, we can approve it and move on. The next step is go through to the finance department. One of the people in charge is Ashley. Login as Ashley. We can see everything we have previously seen on the form as well as Janet's approval. Once approved, it goes back to the creator of the form. Now that everything be revealed and approved, we can now send the form to Archimedica. We can now check if everything went through on Archimedica's side. Here it is. We can see that it successfully went through and if we check on it, we can see all the information that we add in Eva. We can also see the file attached here. Beside the web application, you can carry out the same exact function on your mobile application. After logging in Eva in your mobile app, you can reach the same form from the same directory as the web application. The functions of filling the form or browsing the log are all available in your mobile application. Please leave us a thumb up if you enjoyed the video. You are more than welcome to visit our official YouTube channel or contact us directly to schedule a free demonstration session of EBA. Thank you for watching. This is Sam of Bimser International.